Hello and welcome to the new Load Notice Designer. To get started, you can either create a new account, which will be accepted by the Warehouse Partners team, or you can log in with an existing account. If you've forgotten your details, that's not a problem. Using the link below, Forgotten Password, you'll be able to reset your password. So I'm going to log into my account. As you can see, uh, there are tabs across the top where you can view services offered by Warehouse Partners. Alternatively, you can start using the Low Notice Builder. At the top, we have Featured Categories, and in those Featured Categories, you'll be able to choose from the old star signs, which I know a lot of the customers of Warehouse Partners and the Low Notice Designer like, or additional products. Alternatively, you can utilise the new style of designs which again, some users have stated that they like. So, if we go into the old style no, load notice signs, we can see uh, the style of design here. So adjustable pallet racking would be the one that we're interested in. If I click on this, this will take me into the next section. So I've chose the sign that I want, which is adjustable pallet racking. I can now choose the size of the load notice. So SRA3, A4, A5. I'm gonna stick with SRA3. Uh, I can choose the quantity of signs that I'd like to purchase. I'm going to click Start, and this will load the editor. Similar to the editor on the old system, uh, you have various boxes that you can tick or untick. Alternatively, you can fill out these boxes below. Uh, and what this will do is automatically fill out on the left-hand side. So Project Reference, I'm going to call it Proj123. Date Supplied, I'm going to select the 30th of November. And as you can see, it's automatically updating on the left. I can type in the rows, so 5,000 or 500 kg. And this will update the, uh, the pallets. I can choose how many um, pallets I want to, to have on here. So similar to the old system, you have one to four. So I can change that and it will automatically update. So I want two. I can carry on working while that updates. Uh, I can do the, the next row along, so row two. So that might be 100. Kg um, top might be 100 kg, and again we can select the the box layout that we want. So free box layout, for instance. Okay, so I've done that, and now I'm happy with my sign. What I can do is I can if I just scroll down, I can add that to my basket. If I'm not happy with my sign, if I haven't completed it, but I have to run out of the office, so I've been called, uh, I need I need to get away away from my desk. What you can do is save as project, and this will save it into um, a section in your your client area for completion later on um, when you're happy to continue with it. So I'm going to click on Add to Basket. Okay, so now this has been added to my basket. I already have one item in my basket, um, but you'll be able to see that I've just just added one in here. So you can see a preview on the left hand side. You can select a delivery date. You can add a SAP number albeit I know there's only a few uh, customers that are using that. You can enter a discount code if you've been given one. Alternatively, you can check out. You can see the subtotal, the delivery cost, etc. all here. If you check out, you can submit your billing address or alternatively add a new address. You can select your uh, delivery methods, so first class or collect from warehouse partners. Uh, Collection is obviously free, but I'm going to go with first class and continue. And the payment method is purchase order. It always is purchase order, and this will work out your delivery cost, your VAT, etc. If I continue again, I can submit my PO number, so I can type in whatever my PO number is in there. If I click continue again, that will take me to the confirmation screen, and I'll just confirm the order. Once I've done that, my order has been placed and that has gone to um, the warehouse partners team ready for distribution. So that is um, the load notice system. If I leave this page and we go back to the home page and I'm looking for some additional products now. I want some products to go with my order. Um, you have various to choose from, so fixing kits, texture, drill attachments, etc. Um, you can go onto the next page and see more products that are available. 